What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, people? My life here today. Just bring you a little mystery box unboxing. I know it's not an unboxing, but I made a video earlier and I kind of didn't like the way the video came out. It looked kind of crazy, sounded kind of crazy. So now trying to redeem myself and get the video back going better, a little bit better quality. So up first we have wet mirror finish by Chemical Guys. Next up we got Mr. Pink. Next up we got that V07. Next up we got that Fabric Guard. Next up we got that Morning Wood. I was kind of thrown back when I seen it said Morning Wood because I didn't want to keep looking in the box. <laughs> that word Morning Wood is not something that you just place on a bottle and think it's like ah but it must smell like that morning wood i don't live in the country i live in the city so the fresh air smell like pollution if you <laughs> ask me so let's dive right into it the things that you see in front of us is what we got in the mystery box what you see over here is what I ordered on the side. I wanted to um, try out the buttery wet wax and I wanted to see what type of polishing rags they got out now per se. Cause tell you the truth, I'm not even gonna lie. When I opened this up, I was looking for like a satin, like some kind of silk finish on the edge and I can I can no lie I love chemical guys you know I watch my cousin wash his car and all of that but I kind of was looking for like something with like some silk on the edges you know but not mad at it I picked it up I know what to do the next time shop around in the chemical guys section <laughs> all right and I picked up a dirt trap now if you ask me out of all of the dirt traps that I've seen out, by far, this one has to be the best design for the bucket. Now, I know you might say, well, they all got holes and they all drop to the bottom. But if you actually look inside of this, which we really can't see, they turn into cones. You understand? So when the dirt goes down, the dirt stays trapped down in the bottom of the barrel or the bucket, however you want to call it. Those other grit guards are good per se. I will have this one at the bottom and then I will have the other grit guard at the top only because the other one does a good job with cleaning it. But this one does a good job with keeping the sediments at the bottom of the bucket. If that makes sense, hit me in the comments and let me know what you think. But with that being said, I kind of unbox this so I can get out my list and actually show you what was ordered from this mystery box. So with that being said, I'm going to take you over here real quick so you can see that I'm not lying about what I got in the mystery box. I put the prices on the side like so. Sorry for the chicken scratch. And then same for these. Let's get a focus going on. All right. And then I put the total at the top of this paper right here. Total was 77. What I paid for the mystery box was $29 plus $2 plus $3 for shipping and handling. And the extra goodies that I got on the side. Was this a good mystery box? Hell yeah. I can't say you get what you pay for because it's called the mystery box. Can you be mad at what you got in the mystery box? Yeah, that's how you feel. But once again, it's a mystery box and you don't know what you're getting in the mystery box. That's why it's called mystery. It's a mystery on what you're getting. So if anybody is hurt or sore about what they didn't get or what they should have got or kind of didn't get, Try and do what I do. Buy a little bit of things on the side and then buy a mystery box. You understand what I'm saying? Because then at least you know you're getting what you want 
and not something that you don't want. Now, I'm not saying that I'm not going to use all of this stuff and I'm not going to say I don't need it. But what I'm saying to those of who are out there, be appreciative of what you get. With that being said, it's my life and Chemical Guys, and we're out.